What's up? I'm Mackenzie Wilson, and I'm on the Baylor softball team, and today I'm here with... Ray J. Dennis. So, tell me a little bit about your journey to Baylor. Uh, yeah, so I was raised in uh, Plainfield, Illinois, and then um, I, like, I was decently recruited by a bunch of mid-majors coming out of high school, and uh, originally I went to Boise State for two years and got a lot of good experience, and then um, transferred to Toledo for uh, two more years, and thankful to COVID, I got an extra year to be here at Baylor to finish it off. Why did you choose Baylor? What drew your attention to Baylor University? Uh, when I was going through the recruiting process, uh, a lot of coaches calling me and everything, but the people here and the coaching staff and some of the players I met beforehand just seemed like real authentic and the love they had seemed real genuine, so that's what I was drawn to. And your family, are they going to be able to get out to some games? How have they impacted you, influenced your basketball career? Um, I mean, they're, they're the reason I'm the basketball player and man I am today. Uh, and they'll be able to get out to some games. It's a little far, but they'll make it, especially with this being my last year. They'll get out here for sure. As I look here at this long list of accolades, I see unanimous MAC Player of the Year. I see you led Toledo to their third straight MAC championship. Out of all these things, I know that's a lot, there's probably so many more. What has been your favorite or most cherished basketball memory up until this point? It's probably a tie. Um, winning the three titles and uh, two while I was there was uh, really fun just because we had a really close team and you get to spend all the time with your brothers and being able to make history in that program was fun and, and I'm all about winning. That's what I love to do. So that's been the first one. And then uh, the second one is probably when I was at Boise State and uh, we had a game and we were kind of having a rough season and we needed a turnaround and I scored 19 points in three minutes and we came back and ended up winning. Ray J. Dennis with all 19 of his points in the final 327. If you didn't play basketball, what would you play? Golf, for golf. sure. Why golf? It's just fun, it's competitive. Um, not a lot of people are good at it. That's fact. I'm not even good at it yet, but I will be. I don't know too many people that are good at golf, but you're, you're gonna get there. Yeah, I'll get there, it. I'll get there. Favorite basketball player? Um, all time is Kobe Bryant. Okay, RIP. And if you had to put together a, a starting lineup uh, of people in the NBA, different teams, who are you choosing? All time? Yeah, all time starting five. Steph, Kobe, Michael Jordan, LeBron, and Shaq. That's legit. You went on the foreign tour yeah. over the summer. What? was one of your favorite memories of, of being there? I don't know if it's a specific memory, but like, probably just like, oh yeah, one night we all got uh, the Lime app. Okay. And you know, we got on, <laughs> we got on these bikes, the Lime bikes, yeah. and was just riding around Paris and we had like the whole team with us. So oh, it was just that's like always a fun. mob of Lime bikes. So you talked about how you have this mindset of winning, you love to win, how, as a newcomer on the team, how are you bringing your senior leadership and your mindset of winning to this team to help them potentially win a championship? Because I know that's the goal. Yeah, just like you said, trying to use my experience and uh, the things that I've learned along my college career and just help like the younger guys and even my other teammates and really just take it day by day and, and just get better and focus on getting better every day. There you have it, Baylor family. Thank you, Ray J. Dennis, for joining us today and talking to us a little bit about your journey and how you got to Baylor. Sick and Bears. Sick.